Alright guys, I'm back with an iX270. This is an iTronics iX270. Um, and on this one I'm going to show you how to upgrade your memory and or replace your Wi-Fi card because they're under the same cover. So we have six screws in the cover to the right of the hard drive cover. And we remove those. Then you pry this up, and then here you will see your Wi-Fi card. And then under this cover, under this plate, you have both of your memory slots. So you have to remove these two screws. Then you push in, lift up, and then pull away, or pull towards you. And then this will also bring out the CMOS battery right there. So then you grab your memory and just clip it in. If you're removing it to replace both of your sticks, you just simply remove that. And these run a DDR2 PC2 5300. Okay, and then to simply uh, cover this up, you put your, to be careful, sometimes it'll get stuck, so you put your CMOS battery at an angle like this, wires going out through this gap here, let me uh, make sure that you guys are focused on this, <clears throat> okay, so we just grab the CMOS battery, have the wires come out through this gap here, let it sit there like that, and just simply slide it back into place. Slide it beyond. You have uh, a lip here that you have to push down and slide towards you a little bit. Line up your screw holes. Put the two screws into this plate. Replace your cover. Oh, I forgot. There you go. If you're replacing your Wi-Fi card, you simply just put this aside for a second. You have to undo two screws. So you have your black wire, which is the main. The Wi-Fi card will tell you main and auxiliary. The gray one is your auxiliary. You undo, let me get a smaller bit. Um, the screws for The cover and this plate are a number one Phillips head screwdriver and a double zero for the Wi-Fi uh, screws. Okay, and then you just remove these two skinny long black uh, screws out of there. This will pop up on its own and then you just slide it out. And then when you're replacing your Wi-Fi card, you just make sure you put this little black bracket like so. Okay, then you just simply line it up, it only goes in one way. Grab one of your screws. Simply push it down. Make sure that your uh, your antenna wires are not getting crimped under the Wi-Fi card screws. Then you just replace those two screws. Plug, uh, plug in your main antenna wire. Kind of shove that back in there like that. Grab your auxiliary antenna wire. Line it up. Uh, sometimes they want to move just because they're curved. They've been sitting there for quite some time that way, so it just line it up, clip it back in, replace the Kapton tape, and yours should have a little sticker like mine here where it has a, a black arrow pointing this way and a white arrow pointing this way. 
Okay, so then we just replace the cover after you've replaced your memory card and upgraded or replaced your Wi-Fi card or installed one if yours didn't come with one for some reason if you bought it used and upgrade your memory. Replace the six screws. Let me get my number zero bit. Number, number one. Alright, and now we are completely done upgrading your memory and or installing or replacing your Wi-Fi card. Thanks for watching, I hope this helps. Um, I will be making other videos on these units. Uh, this one I had to upgrade the RAM, so I figured I'd make a video on that. Um, thanks for watching, hope this helps. Have a good night.